Homelessness is an issue that doesn't just affect adults, it also impacts young people. The Barnstable County Department of Human Services has been awarded a grant of more than $230,000 to assess and address this need on Cape Cod. The Department of Human Services is one of the about 10 departments that are part of the regional county government for Barnstable County, which is all of Cape Cod. Um, our primary mission is really to plan and implement regional responses to pressing health and human service needs. Part of that role is looking at opportunities for funding. And so in that role, there was an opportunity at the state level for this particular grant, which came out of the Executive Office of Health and Human Services, specifically targeting homeless youth and young adult. The exact number of homeless youth on Cape Cod is currently unknown. We are at the beginning of a community-wide needs assessment to really understand um, what the needs, what are, what's the prevalence and what are the characteristics of these youth and young adults who may be homeless. You can imagine it's a difficult population to count. They may not be visibly homeless, they may be doubling up or they may be sleeping in somebody's couch or situations like that. The grant funds will be dispersed to several key organizations. Champ Homes plans to expand their life skills offerings. The Homeless Prevention Council will extend office hours and enhance case management services. And the Housing Assistance Corporation will work to learn more about the at-risk youth population. So we are a sub-grantee through the County of Barnstable for an Executive Office of Health and Human Services grant, specifically targeting unaccompanied youth. So. Um, youth who are under the age of 25, who are not in the care or custody of a guardian, um, someone who has left their family of origin, someone who is aged out of the foster care system and is no longer eligible for those resources. Um, so these folks tend to be incredibly vulnerable. They're at high risk for exploitation and substance use and not being able to maintain housing in a way that actually helps them take care of themselves. The Homeless Youth Services Grant will be used to analyze and address barriers to identification of at-risk homeless youth. Part of the grant is doing a community needs assessment and really having a consultant come in and look at what the current region looks like because we don't have a good sense of baseline numbers. Um, we're expecting it to be larger than what we think it is um, just because these folks typically have difficulty accessing resources, it's a hard system to navigate, um, and so it's people that we're not necessarily engaging with in a different context. Our hope, my hope, and, and I, is to, once we get through this baseline needs assessment, community needs assessment process, we will have a better idea of who those, who we're really working with, and then what strategic interventions we can fund in year two and beyond that will really make an impact on um, preventing the homelessness to begin with and, and if somebody is homeless that we're doing a really good job of connect, engaging them and connecting them to appropriate services. The Barnstable County Department of Human Services expects to complete the baseline assessment this summer. For Cape Media News, I'm Gabrielle Rawson.